Um, hey, welcome to my tutorial on how to edit weapons using uh, Garden of Eden Creation Kit. It's called GEC for Fallout 3. And um, to do this, first off, click File Data. Double click Fallout3.esm and load it up. I already did that, so I'm not gonna. But <clears throat> when you're done with that, you have to, um, first off, go to your cell view. This is and just load whichever place you want. I'm gonna load Megaton. Pretty much I'll start creating tutorials how to do um pretty much most of this stuff. I'll teach you what the cell does and oh yeah but anyway I'll teach you how to do most of this stuff but um for now I'm just gonna teach you how to create weapons, edit weapons and uh do all of that stuff. So uh the weapon I'm probably going to be editing today would be the combat shotgun. And. Yeah. One sec. Alright, so, um, anyway. Now. You have to. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add the weapon to the game. I'll also I will also teach you how to do that. Well, just look for a web shotgun combat. Then go to your render window. I'll teach you how to move around too. I'm, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna teach you to almost do everything. Drag it in there, I'm going to turn on Havoc Sim. Sorry, I'm having a little trouble with this right now. There we go. I'm just going to add this right there. It will drop once you start the game if you have Havoc Sim running right now. So, turn on the light. See, turn on Havoc Sim and it drops right down. So, um, now to edit the weapon, you have to double click it. Double click the shotgun. Actually, yeah, just click edit base on it and that will pop up. And, um, right here it says ID name combat shotgun. Let's just make one, let's just make a shotgun that's kind of like a single shot and, um, that's really powerful. So first off, let's change the ID to single shot shoddy. That's what I'm going to do. Now I'm going to paste that into the name. Make them, I'm making them the same. So script, you don't need to do script. That really has nothing, unless if you're really good at scripting. But object effect, you can like make it so it has artillery strike, centaur radiation, poison, ant sting, Flames. Let's just make ooh flamer effect. Let's click that. It's gonna catch them on fire. The ammunition. That's the type of ammunition it uses. Let's just keep it. I'm gonna keep that shotgun shell. Clip rounds. That's how many clips. I mean, that's how many bolts are in a clip. So I'm gonna change that to seven. Its skill is like what if category falls into big guns, energy weapons, small guns. I'm gonna keep it small guns. Its weight. I'm gonna bring it down to. Four health, five hundred. It's reached the fire rate. This, I'm gonna put that to five. It's spread. We don't want spread since it's only shooting one bullet. It's, it'd be kind of hard. So, um, the minimum spread. Re, uh, remember to bring that down to zero too. Otherwise, it's gonna get really glitchy. 
<coughs> it's damaged, I'm going to keep it there, value, let's make it 378 or something. Damage, 55, it's fine. Ammo use, that means how many bullets it uses for one shot. Project projectiles, um, that's how many bullets shoots at it once. I'm going to change that to one. And on hit, it explodes or that. Let's make it no uh, normal formula behavior. So I'm gonna make this player. Oh wait, nah. Can drop. Not use comic norms. All right. Let's just go to art and sound now. That's your pit boy image. You could like upload your own. Maybe put it in the file or anything. You could edit that. You could change its model. If you're really good at modeling, you can use stuff like Blender, Nif Scope, and you could edit that. And um. It's armorless. You don't really need that. It projectile. That's what bullet shoots out of it. So you, I'm gonna just keep it shotgun shell. Attack sounds what it sounds like when you shoot it. I think it uh, for me. I think it's fine now. So I'm just gonna keep it like that. I might add um, one of my releases. I might add a scope to my shotgun, but. For now, it's just, it's okay now. Uh, like, if you've watched Neo Bethesda's videos on how to edit stuff, it says right here, you always uh, click yes, otherwise it will change all of the combat shotguns in the game, so always click yes. Never click no. Alright, so, click okay. I'm gonna delete this one for now. Oh yeah, and if you ever mess up, you can just control Z. It's my single shot is shot is right here. So let's just drag that into there. Bring it up a little bit. I'm gonna rotate it. Back up a little bit. I'm gonna drag it over there. And if you have Havoc Sim going, it's just gonna float back up if it goes down, so it's fine. Alright, so now what you can do is you can save your gun if most of you already know how to just click file save save it as a new plugin like single I'm just gonna name it single shot test alright so now I'm just gonna save that and now here in a sec I'm gonna record a video on how it's going so